Just a week ago, my dad sent me a picture of me standing in front of a computer when I was like three. And the story behind it is that my kindergarten teacher asked me, Faros, what's your favorite subject? And I said, computers. And so she took a picture of me in front of the class computer. I built this site in freshman year of high school that just collected all my favorite games and videos from across the internet. I was literally just like taking up other people's work and just putting it on my site. And then like tons of people came to the site and I was like, whoa, this is, like, I just built this thing and put it out there and like everyone likes it. That's cool. I should build more things. And then I built this site called instant.fm, which is a music site that's sort of like Spotify in your browser. Um, it hasn't really uh, taken off because it's not really a company. It's just a, literally a, a project. And then, so I built YouTube Instant, that's the one everyone knows about. I had this idea, it just randomly popped into my head about a website uh, that would be just like Google Instant, because Google Instant just came out the day before, but it would, it would be for YouTube videos. So um, instead of typing in um, letters and getting search results to appear instantly, you would type in letters and random videos would start to play. And then I just started working on it and I finished it in three hours. And then I just posted a link to my Facebook because I, I figured like my friends probably want to see this. Um, and then the site went viral overnight. It just literally shared it to my Facebook and, and my Twitter. And then um, people started like writing articles about it, and they thought it was really awesome. And it just took off. Uh, and and then like two like two days later, uh, the CEO of YouTube, Chad Hurley, at the time, um, sent me a tweet and said, "Do you want to work at YouTube?" Last summer I worked at Cora, and the summer before I worked at Facebook on the, the groups team. Uh, we launched the new version of Facebook Groups, uh, one that like lets you uh, add any of your friends without asking them to a group. <laughs> the thing that everyone hates. So I don't have any place in mind where I want to work after I graduate. Uh, I'm gonna just uh, spend at least three months um, just like building out ideas that I've had for a really long time. I'm probably gonna do Stardex or Y Combinator during that three month period um, and I'll see what comes of it. When I'm not programming, I like to play video games, or run, or uh, slightly embarrassed to admit, but yes, I like anime. One thing that's kind of nice about anime is that the characters can have like much more broad, like a diversity of facial expressions than real people can. What the hell are you doing coming back here? It's weird at first when you first watch it, you're like, whoa, why are these guys just like going all out? They're like acting really sad, really happy, really goofy, really everything. And, but then once you get used to it and you accept like this is the way the genre is, then you just appreciate it more.